How to add a handling fee for shipping in Shopify. Hey everyone and welcome. I hope you're all doing great. In this video, I'll show you step by step how to achieve this. Now, this is going to be very easy and simple to do. And basically, we're just going to specify the shipping fees and the handling fees on our um, well, shipping options. So how do we do so? It's very easy. So just go ahead and open up your Shopify admin. And you want to go to the settings down below at the bottom left click on that and then basically you want to click on the shipping and delivery which should be down here in the middle so just go and click on that and then basically you want to select the zone that we want to work with which uh, you know if you just go to the shipping option here click on the general shipping rates so you want to select the rates So by default, you should have the domestic and you also should have the international. So we're going to be doing it for the domestic one and we are going to basically uh, calculate it over here. So now you can just click on add rate. So this one is free delivery. So let's just go to skip it. It is free delivery. So it's going to be completely for free. Uh, but we want to click on add rate to the zone that you want to add the handling fees to. So whether it's domestic, international or a different zone, it's completely up to you. In my case, I'm just going to do it for this one. So just click on add rate. And then from here, we just want to select whether it's going to be flat rate or uh, we want to calculate the rates by a carrier or app. If you do that, then you would want to select the uh, apps that are available for your zone. So in my zone, there are no apps that are available for me. So you can't really pick them, but you can just for your for you, you can just go and select them, the ones that are needed. And then you can just go ahead and add the uh, flat rate or percentage for the handling extra. So they're going to already calculate the rates for shipping, but you only need to add the extra amount for um, for the handling. So you don't need to enter both the amounts. So basically, I'm going to talk uh, exa exactly tell you what I'm trying to say here. So in the case that you don't want to calculate it by... Um, carriers you just want to go for the rate type as a flat and then for the shipping rate is going to be custom you can just go ahead and give it a name i'm just going to name it test and then the description again if you want to add a description is completely up to you but the price you actually want to add the price for the both the delivery and also the handling fees so let's say the de delivery is um for this sake let's just do 30 uh, dirhams so you would want to add even more to it. So the handling fees are, let's say, 10 dirhams extra. So in this case, you would want to remove the 30 and make it 40. So you want to combine both and click on done and you're pretty much good to go. And you also have more conditional stuff here, which is not really our topic for today, but you can feel free to add it. So now in this one, which is the flat rate, you want to add both the delivery and the handling. Now, for the other option, which is going to be click on add rate again, this one right here, you will have the option to add a flat rate again. But this case, you don't add 40 because, you know, the delivery is 30 and the handling is 10. You only add the 10. You only add the handling fees for this one. So this is what I'm, I was trying to explain earlier. And yeah, this is all for this video. Wait, let me just see if I can do it for the UK here. Okay, now it's not going to work. But, but anyway, so I get, I hope that you actually get the idea. If you want to uh, calculate it by a carrier, they're already going to calculate the shipping for you. The only thing that you need to add is the handling fees. So this is all for this video. Hopefully you found it to be helpful. And thanks for watching.